Hello and welcome to our channel, where we take a look at the cast of some of the most iconic movies of all time and see how they have changed over the years. Today, we are going to revisit the 1995 crime thriller Heat, directed by Michael Mann and starring Al Pacino and Robert De Niro. Heat is widely regarded as one of the best movies of the 90s, with its gripping story, realistic action scenes, and memorable performances. But what happened to the actors who played the cops and robbers in this epic showdown? Let's find out. Al Pacino played the role of Lieutenant Vincent Hanna, a dedicated and obsessive LAPD detective who is determined to catch a crew of professional thieves led by Neil McCauley. He is now 83 years old, and he is still active in the industry, appearing in movies like The Irishman and The Godfather Coda, as well as TV shows like Hunters and The Undoing. Robert De Niro played the role of Neil McCauley, a master thief and former convict who lives by a strict code of professionalism and loyalty. He is now 80 years old, and he is still working in the industry, starring in movies like Joker, The War with Grandpa, and The Comeback Trail, as well as producing and directing various projects. Val Kilmer played the role of Chris Sheherlis, a skilled and loyal member of Macaulay's crew, who is also a gambling addict and has a troubled marriage with his wife Charlene. He is now 64 years old, and he has faced some health issues in recent years, including throat cancer, which affected his voice. John Voight played the role of Nate, a fence and mentor figure for Macaulay and his crew, who provides them with information, contacts, and equipment. He is now 85 years old, and he is still working in the industry, appearing in movies like Survive the Night and Roe v. Wade, as well as TV shows like Ray Donovan and 24. Tom Sizemore played the role of Michael Chirito, another member of Macaulay's crew, who is a hot-headed and impulsive thief who often acts on his emotions rather than his logic. He is also known for his personal troubles, such as drug addiction, legal issues, and domestic violence. He died in 2023 at the age of 61 after suffering a heart attack. Diane Venora played the role of Justine Hanna, the wife of Vincent Hanna, who is unhappy and frustrated with her husband's obsession with his work, which neglects their marriage and her daughter Lauren. She is now 71 years old, and she has retired from acting since 2011, after appearing in the TV show The Good Wife. Amy Brenneman played the role of Edie, a graphic designer and Macaulay's love interest, who is unaware of his criminal activities and falls in love with him. She is now 59 years old, and she is still active in the industry, appearing in movies like Words on Bathroom Walls and TV shows like Tell Me Your Secrets. Ashley Judd played the role of Charlene Sheherlis, the wife of Chris Sheherlis, who is fed up with his gambling addiction and his involvement in crime and wants to leave him and start a new life. She is now 55 years old, and she is also an activist who has advocated for various causes, such as women's rights, animal rights, and environmentalism. McKelty Williamson played the role of Sergeant Drucker, a colleague and friend of Vincent Hanna, who assists him in his pursuit of Macaulay and his crew. Williamson gave a loyal and supportive performance to backs up Hanna in his mission. He is now 66 years old, and he is still working in various movies and TV shows in recent years. West Study played the role of Detective Casals, another colleague and friend of Vincent Hanna, who helps him in his investigation of Macaulay and his crew. He is now 75 years old, and he is still active in the industry. He is also the first Native American actor to receive an honorary Oscar in 2019. Ted Levine played the role of Bosco, another colleague and friend of Vincent Hanna, who joins him in his chase of Macaulay and his crew. Levine gave a steady and reliable performance, playing a brave and dedicated character who risks his life for his job. He is now 66 years old, and he is still working in the industry. Dennis Haysbert played the role of Donald Breeden, a former convict who joins Macaulay's crew for a heist, but is also trying to rebuild his life and reconnect with his ex-wife. He is now 69 years old, and he is still active in the industry, appearing in movies like The Dark Tower, as well as TV shows like Lucifer. William Fichtner played the role of Roger Van Zant, a wealthy and ruthless businessman who hires Macaulay's crew for a heist but then betrays them and tries to kill them. He is now 67 years old, and he is still working in the industry, appearing in movies like Coldbrook, as well as TV shows like The Simpsons. 
Natalie Portman played the role of Lauren Gustafson, the stepdaughter of Vincent Hanna and the daughter of Justine Hanna, who suffers from depression and attempts suicide. She is now 42 years old, and she is still active in the industry. She is also an activist for various causes, such as animal rights, women's rights, and environmentalism. Tom Noonan played the role of Kelso, a former criminal and an expert in surveillance and electronics who helps Nate and Macaulay's crew with their heists. He is now 72 years old, and he is still working in the industry, appearing in movies like Late Phases and The Shape of Water as W. LS TV shows like The Blacklist and Room 104. Kevin Gage played the role of Wayne Grow, a psychopathic and sadistic criminal who joins Macaulay's crew for a heist, but then causes a massacre and escapes, becoming Macaulay's nemesis. He is now 64 years old, and he has faced some legal troubles in his life, such as being arrested for drug possession and serving time in prison. Hank Azaria played the role of Alan Marciano, a sleazy and unfaithful businessman who is having an affair with Charlene Sheherlis and becomes a target of both the police and the thieves. He is now 59 years old, and he is best known for his voice work on The Simpsons, where he has voiced over 150 characters. Trejo played the role of Trejo, a loyal and experienced member of Macaulay's crew who is tortured and killed by Wayne Grow. Trejo gave a tough and tragic performance, playing a brave and honorable character. He is now 79 years old, and he has a remarkable life story, as he was a former convict and drug addict who turned his life around and became a successful actor and a philanthropist. Henry Rollins played the role of Hugh Benny, a corrupt and cowardly ex-cop who works for Van Zant and tries to kill Macaulay and his crew. Rollins gave a slimy and sneaky performance, playing a dishonest and disloyal character who betrays his former colleagues. He is now 60 years old, and he is still active in the industry. Jerry Trimble played the role of Danny Schwartz, a security guard who works for Van Zant and tries to stop Macaulay and his crew from robbing him. He is now 62 years old, and he is still working in the industry, appearing in movies like American Maid, Den of Thieves, and The Tax Collector, as well as TV shows like NCIS, Hawaii 50, and SWAT. Martin Ferrero as Construction Clerk Martin Ferrero played the role of Construction Clerk, a minor character who works at a construction site and witnesses Macaulay and his crew escaping from the police. He is now 76 years old, and he has retired from acting since 2001 after appearing in the TV show The District. Ricky Harris played the role of Albert Torina, a minor character who works for Nate and helps Macaulay and his crew with their heists. Harris gave a friendly and helpful performance, playing a cheerful and cooperative character who assists the thieves. He died in 2016 at the age of 54 after suffering a heart attack. Tone Locke played the role of Richard Torina, a minor character who is the brother of Albert Torina and works for Nate and helps Macaulay and his crew with their heists. Tone Locke gave a cool and casual performance, playing a laid-back and relaxed character who supports the thieves. He is now 57 years old, and he is still working in the industry. Jeremy Piven played the role of Dr. Bob, a minor character who is a doctor and a friend of Vincent Hanna, who treats him after he is wounded by Macaulay. Piven has won three Emmys and a Golden Globe. He is now 58 years old, and he is best known for his role as Ari Gold on the TV show Entourage. Xander Berkeley played the role of Ralph, a minor character who is the boyfriend of Lauren Gustafson and a source of conflict for Vincent Hanna and Justine Hanna. Berkeley gave a sleazy and annoying performance. He is now 67 years old, and he is still working in the industry and appearing in various movies and TV shows. That's it for our video on Heat 1995 cast then and now. We hope you enjoyed it and learned something new. If you did, please give this video a thumbs up, subscribe to our channel, and hit the bell icon to get notified of our future videos. Also, let us know in the comments below what other movies you would like us to cover next. Thank you for watching, and we'll see you next time.